Thanissaro Bhikkhu, also known as Ajahn Jeff, born the 28th of December 1949, the 28th of December 1949, is an American Buddhist monk. Belonging to the Thai forest tradition, for 22 years he studied under the forest master Ajahn Fuang Jatiko, himself a student of Ajahn Lee. Since 1993 he has served as abbot of the Meta Forest Monastery in San Diego County, California, the first monastery in the Thai forest tradition in the US. Which he co-founded with Ajahn Sawat Suvako. Thanissaro Bhikkhu is perhaps best known for his translations of the Dhammapada and the Sutta Pitaka, almost 1,000 suttas in all, providing the majority of the Sutta translations for the reference website Access to Insight, as well as for his translations from the Dhamma talks of the Thai forest Ajahns. He has also authored several Dhamma-related works of his own, and has compiled study guides of his Pali translations. Topic. Biography Topic. Early life Thanissaro Bhikkhu was born Geoffrey Degriff in 1949 and was introduced to the Buddha's teaching on the Four Noble Truths as a high schooler, during a plane ride from the Philippines. Tricycle writes, He grew up a very serious, independent little kid. Spending his early childhood on a potato farm on Long Island, New York, and later living in the suburbs of Washington, D.C. Time at Oberlin At Oberlin College in the early 1970s, he eschewed campus political activism because I didn't feel comfortable following a crowd. For him, the defining issue of the day wasn't Vietnam, but a friend's attempted suicide. Thanissaro took a religious studies class when he found out there was meditation involved. Thanissaro writes, I saw it as a skill I could master, whereas Christianity only had prayer, which was pretty hit or miss. <laughs> First trip to Thailand After graduating in 1971 with a degree in European Intellectual History from Oberlin College, he traveled on a university fellowship to Thailand. After a two-year search Thanissaro found a forest teacher, a John Fuang Jatiko, a Kammathana monk who studied under a John Lee Damodaro, who insisted that his scholarly American student put his books aside. After a brief stay with the teacher was cut short by malaria, he returned to the U.S. to weigh the merits of academia and monasticism. Topic. Return to Thailand Thanissaro states that when he returned to Thailand he originally planned on becoming a monk tentatively for five years. When he said that he wanted to be ordained, a John Fuang made him promise to either succeed in the meditation or die in Thailand. There was to be no equivocating. Thanissaro felt certain upon hearing this. Topic. Time with a John Fuang By Thanissaro's third year ordained as a monk, he became a John Fuang's attendant. A John Fuang's case of psoriasis deteriorated. It reached a point where Tan Jeff had to be at his side constantly. Thanissaro writes, When I talked with a John Fuang about going back to the West, about taking the tradition to America, he was very explicit. This will probably be your life's work, he said. He felt, as many teachers have, that the forest tradition would die out in Thailand but would then take root in the West. Topic. Posting at Wat Meta Before Ajahn Fuang's death in 1986, he expressed his wish for Ajahn Jeff to become abbot of Wat Dhammasathit. Thanissaro says that in spite of Ajahn Fuang's wish there were a lot of people maneuvering to become abbot. After Ajahn Fuang died, Wat Dhammasathit had already come far from the outlying forest hermitage that Tan Jeff had once arrived at. Thanissaro said, Ajahn Fuang said to keep moving, this is not a tradition that works well in big groups. Tan Jeff declined the offer of abbot of Wat Dhammasathit, which came with strings attached, and no authority since he was a westerner in a monastery founded by and for Thai monks. Instead of taking that position, he traveled to San Diego County in 1991, upon request of Ajahn Sawat Suvako, where he helped start Meta Forest Monastery. He became abbot of the monastery in 1993. 
In 1995, Ajahn Jeff became the first American born, non Thai bhikkhu to be given the title, authority, and responsibility of preceptor in the Dhammayat order. He also serves as treasurer of that order in the United States. Topic: Teachings. Topic: Classical Buddhist Modernism. Topic: Views on commentarial meditation practice. Thanissaro rejects the practice of kasina outlined in the Visuddhimagga and warns against forms of deep jhana", practiced by contemporary meditation teachers who draw from the commentaries. Thanissaro calls these meditations, "...wrong concentration", and says that they have no basis in the Pali Canon, which he argues should be considered ultimately authoritative. <laughs> Forest as teacher and Buddhist counterculture Thanissaro talks about the importance of the forest to give rise to the qualities of mind necessary to succeed in Buddhist practice. Barbara Rother writes, Like Thoreau, Thanissaro Bhikkhu has founded a kind of Walden as the abbot of the Meta Forest Monastery near San Diego, the first Thai forest tradition monastery in this country. Just as the utopian movement in America was sparked by the advent of the Industrial Revolution, the forest tradition of Theravada Buddhism was developed in Thailand around the turn of the century by Ajahn Moon Bioradato in reaction to the increasing urbanization of the Buddhist monastic communities there. Forest monks abandoned the heavy social demands of the city and devoted themselves to meditation instead. Topic publications Thanissaro Bhikkhu's publications include, translations of Ajahn Lee's meditation manuals from the Thai with each and every breath, a basic meditation guide handful of leaves, a five-volume anthology of Sutta translations The Buddhist Monastic Code, a two-volume reference handbook on the topic of monastic discipline wings to awakening, a study of the factors taught by Gautama Buddha as being essential for awakening the mind like fire unbound, an examination of upadana clinging and nibbana nirvana in terms of Contemporary Philosophies of Fire The Paradox of Becoming, an extensive analysis on the topic of becoming as a causal factor of dukkha suffering, the shape of suffering, a study of Patita Samapada dependent co -arising, and its relationship to the factors of the Noble Eightfold Path skill in questions, a study of how the Buddha's fourfold strategy in answering questions provides a framework for understanding the strategic purpose of his teachings Noble Strategy, the Karma of Questions, Purity of Heart, Head and Heart Together, and Beyond All Directions collections of essays on Buddhist practice meditations 1 to 5 collections of transcribed Dhamma talks Dhammapada a translation a collection of verses by the Buddha and as co-author a college level textbook Buddhist religions a historical introduction aside from Buddhist religions all of the books and articles mentioned above are available for free distribution many are online audio recordings of Dhamma talks are also given freely topic some teaching locations Meta Forest Monastery Portland Friends of Dhamma Bar Center for Buddhist Studies The Cambridge Insight Meditation Center Insight Meditation Center Topic See also Re-establishing Bhikkhuni Ordination References Bibliography Cully, Natalie Multiple Buddhist Modernisms, Jhana in Convert Theravada. PDF, Pacific World, 225-249 Rother, Barbara Fall 1995, Exile Spirit a Profile of Thanissaro Bhikkhu and the Metaphorist Monastery, Tricycle Buddhist Magazine Survival Tactics for the Mind, Thanissaro Bhikkhu Speaks About Tradition, Sexism, and Following the Buddha's Rules, Tricycle Buddhist Magazine, Winter 1998, archived from the original on 9 September 2015 Shankman, Richard 2008, The Experience of Samadhi, An In-Depth Exploration of Buddhist Meditation PDF, Shambhala Thanissaro 2010, The Customs of the Noble Ones, Access to Insight Topic. External links 
Dhamma talks and writings of Thanissaro Bhikkhu Wat Medavanaram Forest Monastery Suttas read aloud Audio archive from the Do-It-Yourself Dharma website Talks at Audiodharma Videos from online retreat on the Ten Perfections <laughs>